What's up everybody, this is Huey, a very sensational, straightforward, humorous and ambitious guy who also play come from South Vietnam. Firstly, I wish you have a good health and a happy day as well. Leave me a thumbs up if you feel alright so that this video will have a chance to piece YouTube algorithm and get to much more people automatically. I really appreciate that. Anyway, have you ever wondered why you're so shy in public and how to improve your communication, expression? Especially if you speak English as your second language. The answer depends on the guy watching this video. Yeah, exactly. No one can help you but yourself. So this video, I'll show you 5 tips to boost your confidence and public speaking skill. Here we go! Tip number 1. Improve the language that you will speak. Even if you're not a language, you still need to learn how to use it professionally. It will make audience have a good impression of you. If you speak a foreign language, you don't have to make an emotional speech suddenly, make your accent clearly instead. A real speak will make audience interested in rather than an energetic one, but they have no idea what the hell are you talking about. To improve your impression, you also need to rehearse, sing practice makes perfect. Perhaps you should do a mirror, stand in front of this, and speak to yourself. Record your speak if you can to fix it better. If you can express it clearly and fluently, you don't struggle to speak and you have confidence. If you're not a specialist in the foreign language that you're supposed to speak, then you must improve it. Definitely, you ought to set up an ecosystem around you to your first new papers, public figures, and follow them on social media. When you reach news, status, it will set in the mindset in your head. You also need to use some platforms, for instance, Family, directly, or if you don't want to spend money, there is some useful sign for you to do that. But talk and link these two apps help you to connect with people to have a casual chat or even debate. Talk with Trangers.com and Omega.com a website simply help you to call with anyone all over the world and have a chat. Different number two, bring life and reality into your speech. Your speech will not be realistic if you only read the text. Your story is also a valuable source. You may tell audience that's one, make a connection between your speak and your life. Even they don't know what are you or they know you well, they only want to know your story. If it's an interesting one. Wow, that's a serious too. We are humans. We are curious eternally. And because you tell a story, you will not be nervous as you will have a pleasant space in that speak if you don't have any exciting story. You should bring some example we connect with this world. If there are so many of them, try to memorize by talking voice and express it by your words. Don't dump a written text into your mind. Learn by heart and speak instead. Of course, you need to have visual aid as well. Spring, projector, slideshow, with picture and video. Audience will adore you because sometimes your voice is not good enough to persuade them to listen to you. Number three, don't give a damn about audience attitude. If you want to have a good presentation, you have to interact with audience. That's true. However, it's about your style, body language, and contents. You make them feel excited. But just in case they react something isn't as you expected, even they laugh, mock, or appreciate you, don't care about it. Don't stop, and please go ahead. If you try to notice what they react your presentation, you might prove your plan, your preparation only be perfect if you do it smoothly without hesitation. Your attention to audience reaction make you whether arrogant or nervous. If they praise you, you have too much confidence and even delusion and no longer concentrate on your presentation. They blast you, you will be confused. It also have the same consequence. Be yourself, keep your mind in your speech. I know some guys here will be confused when you want to interact. You look at your audience's eyes and you are frozen. You lose your confidence for doing that. What are the most effective tips that you may look at the top of their head? You don't feel nervous, but your audience will think that you look at their eyes directly. It's a trick. From their point of view, it doesn't have any difference as the distance between the top of head and eyes is very close. Consequently, they cannot realize that. Secret number four, have a role model. One of the most popular ways to learn a new language is try to listen to native speakers. In this case, it may be the same. 
if you want to speak confidently in public. You should watch and learn from experts in this field. You should find some podcasts or go on YouTube to look for videos of excellent speakers and learn not just their expression but also their body language. Your teachers sometimes help you feel confident and make audience pay attention to you speak more. Secret number five: Put your feet up. Take a deep breath right before you start speaking. It helps you gain mental energy and sweep away your tremble. Don't put a high expectation on your presentation. Try the bright put the phone. Consider it a normal task. If you fail, the world is still fine. And also never finish your preparation just in the nick of time. Com- complete it soon and spend one day or at least half a day to relax. Don't try to think about it anymore. It should make you nervous. It's a lot of attraction. You have positive thinking and you have positive results. Then, positive thinking in this case is a comfortable mind. So my video got to come to an end now. I really appreciate you for watching and listening to me. If you like this content and you do not yet hit the like button, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe my channel for updating latest videos or information. I'm really grateful for that. I hope you will succeed in your life and gain big achievements. Alright, it's pretty good for today. Hope you will keep watching my next videos. Later!